And welcome back, loyal subjects of Funk, to this Let's Funking player. We're on two total war, and things are getting really tense here. Annoyingly tense. Lepidus is somehow finding ways of uh, taking some settlements of mine. And I'm just. I'm trying my best. So let's manage this. We managed to destroy two massive stacks last uh, last session, which was. We shall put aside the swords and draw the bow. The arrow will strike where it will, and widows will win. Right. Okay. I'll call on my my allies. We're now at war with a shitload of countries, which is worrying. They must be taking advantage of the fact that we are weak. So we're going to have our work cut out again. My Pact Lord of non-aggression, absolutely, I'll go for that. The last thing I need is more enemies. What I need is more trade partners as well. Oh, more attrition, what the hell is this? Slums in Carfago, food shortage, rebellion imminent, increase in rank. Right, okay. <sighs> okay, so that's this guy here. Oh no, he's now healing. Uh, but we've still got minus one in food. Okay, let's go and um, we'll go normal stance. Oh, sod off! I bet we can we can follow him. Yes. Oh yes, and we get help from the garrison. Awesome. Right, another rebellion squashed. What we need to do is just swap to bread and games. That gives us food, doesn't it? March you back there. Right, okay, right, let's swap to Bread and Games. Who is it that has Bread and Games? Bread and Games gives us food, doesn't it? Four food. And this spot here. Oh, well, wealth granted by culture as well. That's awesome. Right, okay. Next move is to take our man here. Put him on a standard stance. We'll get him, start getting him marched back up here towards the settlement that we want to recapture. And we'll get enough gold in next time to get rid of some of these friggin... whatchamacallums. Well, we're now... let's have a look see if we can get any trade deals. We can trade with these lot, but I don't think they'll want to. Of the afterlife. Spare my heart. We can... Trade with Iceni, but I don't think they'll want to. Come, come, let me hear your talk. I warn you. Chances are low, and that's it. So no trade deals for us yet. However, we're going to get lots of food back next turn, which is one massive positive. Now we need to focus on what's going to happen here. So we're at war with them. Right, now that Antony is basically out the game, he can't do anything. We're going to bring one of our stacks, dock him in Ephesus, where we know we'll be safe as houses. Because that garrison isn't strong enough to get rid of a massive army. Right, all is good for now. We need to reconquer Hadramentum. Oh, we've got skills to assign. And yeah, you can have. We need something that'll give food. We'll go for that one. As some administration bonuses. Right, next turn. Should see a shitload of uh, cash come our way. I'm gonna go for bread and games again. Absolutely gonna go for bread and games. We'll then turn. Let's just make sure that this uh, food problem doesn't come back around again, eh? And we'll move this, um... Oh, what the fuck's that? Oh, well, that's all we need, isn't it? Well, I'll tell you what we'll do first. 
might be the most wisest option. I'm gonna go right back up to Hadramentum. It's a pity you can't demand surrender on this because I'm sure there's a lot of garrisons that would rather surrender than um, rather surrender than fight that stupid battle. Oh, we've lost some cavalry. So look at that. What a nightmare. Actually done done ourselves a bit of a disservice there. Alright. Uh, plus 10 morale for all armies. Why not? And let's see what we can hire before we venture out again. Maybe we can get some new median calves. Oh, yes. That's got a rather poor upkeep that uh, makes me wince. Tell you what I might get. Some auxiliaries. I do. I'm a big fan of auxiliaries, and they're cheap. Damn sight better than vigils. Disciplined as well. I'm, I'm not well armoured. Also, oh, we can can only afford one of them. Sounds about right. Okay, let's just get the one then. Oh, what's this, eh? You've been trying it on, my man. That's not not what I like to see at all. Oh, we need to get rid of those slums as well. Right, let's have a look around here. How's it going? I am going to get into the water. Because Ibosim is going to become ours. There we go. Right, so. Money's starting to come back in. Just. Food is certainly starting to come back in. Up to 20 now. I don't even know why I built that irrigation uh, ditch. And, um... Hopefully we can build on this. That's a positive. Antony's Rome's technically still in the game, but they are out of it. Unless they can find a settlement that you don't have to fight a garrison and you can just occupy. He's out of the game. So then. I have been missing Rome too, actually, recently, even though... Even though I've been producing about two videos of it every day. It's not good enough for the king. He loves Rome too. Why hasn't... <laughs> they still haven't... Um, Lepidus Rome still hasn't just occupied that province I took to the south. Don't know why. Rebellion in Carthago. Rebellion Im imminent. Oh yes. Plus the public order. Lovely stuff. Right, let's... Um, what have we got here? I really don't like it when you have... Nicely trained units like that. To battle! Right, where's he at? Where's he gone? Oh, we can, re we can chase after him. Die, die, die. We will release these set of captives, actually. And start marching back. And on the way back, we might as well train another auxiliary. Two will do. What do you mean, minus gold? Um, pardon. Why haven't these lot <laughs> just waltzed back in? We don't have a garrison there at all. They're just pissing about. Probably trying to lure us down. Right, okay, let's get your boss him. Right. Well, we'll go for aggressive then. Yeah! Followed by a swift occupy. Lovely stuff. That's just put our gold down further. Rather upset about that. We were doing good then before. And now it's dropped like a Nazi. Right, let's have a look. Outraged happiness. Who's the unhappy? Uh, don't want to look at troops recruited. Want to look at the unhappy populace. Right, yeah, that's all right. Oh, it's ha getting happier now. In fact, it looks very pleased. And uh, is Ibo Ibosim is part of this. Uh, we get a meeting place if you don't mind. <sighs> yeah, that's all part of the same province. And this one is. Oh no! The monkey's uncle's gone on here. Right, we'll march north. Get these ones a little bit healed. Next turn, we might start making money again if we're lucky. If. Oh, we're going to lose 123 friggin' coins, but that's fine. 
as long as we aren't in the red. I think the problem is we've just expanded way too fast on this. We've went from we've went from a, a handful. Well, we basically just conquered the whole of Spain and uh, Carthage in the space of two sessions, or maybe even most of it was done in what, a single session. We'll have to do a quick march because we need to get these guys down so we can have some fights in uh, the south, perhaps. I'm gutted about losing that uh, cavalry though because we can't get that now unless we walk all the way back to uh, Beneventum up there, which is uh, piss poor. Right. Let's go for a protective stance. See if it can take down as many as it can. Oh. Right, so we're gonna have to take over this uh, province here now, which is a little bit annoying. Mission failed. Oh well, rebellion imminent. Where's that? Here. That's because they're stirring up trouble. But who cares about that? And we'll try and take back this province. And let me guess, we can't march there in a single turn. Well, that sounds about right, doesn't it? <laughs> okay, back into the positives of making money, which is good. And we've got a lot of population surpluses and whatnot coming in, so... Things are looking alright. Might even... Oh, look at that. Eight as well on the uh, public order. Yeah, we'll go back to Novo Carfago. And we'll move our big man. Where's he at? Here he is. That cavalry is looking a lot better. Oh, and look at that. Don't even have to... Um... You know what? I'll put this on forced march. And we'll just march to the border. Because now we've got a, a nice public order bonus going on around here. Shit. Pity we can't get rid of that uh, slums. Because it costs us 500. That's a bit annoying. We'll get that next turn then. We'll come down here, hopefully have a bit of a Barney with uh, Lepidus Rome. After uh, This is the army that won the amazing battle, by the way. So, I'm not arguing there. And we'll just end turn, see what happens. Hopefully we won't get caught off guard while we're doing a forced march. Anthony's Rome, I don't even know why it's still in the game. Taking its turn, but there we go. Decided again not to take our province, but to actually instead just sit in that pro. Must be trying to lure me down or something. I was quite impressed with the AI last ses session. It done a lot better job than it usually does. And defensive allies with. I propose, or rather ask for, a treaty. To combine our forces with your considerable strength. All right, okay. They've got very good relations with a lot of other provinces, so yeah, why not? It's about time we made some friends on this. Numidia, Persia, and here we go again. We're back in it. Ooh, what's this rebellion here? Right, okay, so, it's actually just taken the city out, right, just occupied it. And who's this here? Is this a friend? That's Numidia. They're coming to, um, show off. And we'll go back up here. We're going to have to take this settlement, it's going to be difficult. Oh, look at the size on it. Right, we'll encircle. Uh, we do have a bit of money, so we will get something cheap, like them, for a start. And we still have 400 left. But what do we want is the question, what's the most powerful or value for money? We've got 400 to spare. Let's click again, see what... Billy BS. Tell you what we'll do. We'll hire another one. But we'll hire cavalry, I think. None will escape. And we'll just surround that this turn. They should be starving as well, I hope. 
Well, they should be. And uh, if they come out to attack us, they come out to attack us. And we'll fight that battle and defeat those uh, rebels. So let's in turn see what those uh, rebels decide to do. Really knocked off about that. Antony's Rome. We'll probably do nothing. I want to know what uh, Numiji does because I'm going to get pissed off if they start going around conquering Lepidus uh, provinces. I'm going to start getting really pissed off. But I might leave that one actually or maybe go that way. I don't know yet. I'm, I'm thinking and thinking and thinking because obviously we've got no garrison there as well. Because we just don't have the tech to convert that uh, that building. Oh! Lepidus has took it back. That's fantastic. We should have perhaps done a force march to the end. I don't know if we can get all the way through there. We might be able to do it. However, we'll probably be battling said rebels this time. We'll see how that goes. They'll probably come out to attack us. But we'll find out. Oh, shit. Area. Fuck me, I'm pissed off about that. Here we go, here's Iberia. However, the garrison is good enough to defend. Which I'm very surprised about. We'll go for protective stance, sir. Close victory. And kill them. Shit, so we're at war with basically the people who inhabit Portugal now. Not necessarily a bad thing, because I suppose that... Here we go. Right, let's uh, do a quick save. I can't see why we would lose this. That's a shitload of vigils, actually. But we might be able to lure them in in some shape or form. We do have cavalry. I'm going to fight this on the map, I think. Yeah. We'll see what we can do. Okay. Ooh, yes. I like this. Oh, no, wait on. All the friggin' mountains are on their side! Bollocks! But you know what? As the enemy is coming in as a reinforcement, we might stand a chance. Let's quickly just deploy there and start. We'll see what the hell we can do. If we can get up here fast, beating the enemy sort of thing. And we might stand a chance, but we'll see how that goes. We'll get the cavalry up here first. I'm just going for it. Just got to take some real big risks in this battle. Look at that there. Nice defensive position up there. We could zing down some spears from there. Eh? These are going up fast. Right, no one in sight. That's brilliant. Oh, here we go. Right, so where, the question is, though, where's the reinforcements coming from? Yes! This is fantastic news, guys. Obviously, these lot are going to uh, join up with these, but we'll set up and receive the enemy. So, the enemy approach. We're going to do a little bit of skirmishing, hopefully, up here. We'll see how that goes. Might even have a blast with the cavalry at taking out some skirmishes. Um, we have a very good high ground here. And obviously this is the, the the strong point. Not only that, we've got troops hidden behind that uh, ridge. Which is actually, you can't walk on there. It's impassable uh, rock, hopefully. Or maybe not. We're not going to have any, any cigar there, are we? However, it's good because we can actually bug them from here. Right, so we're actually killing quite a lot on this air ridge. I'm very pleased about this. Well, I'm going to bring these lot back now. The hunters are very valuable to me. Oh, do yourself a favour. Here we go. These are going to have a crack at the vigils while the rest get back. Wow, I'm so knocked off about that. I hate it when stuff like that happens. In fact, what I might do is, is just put a, a thing across there like that. Then 
There we go. Cut the leader off. Haha. <laughs> Do you want to... Shit, go away. Right. Right, so, with that being done there, it might lure some enemies down and we can... Oh, shit. What have we done? Might have to refight this battle if it all goes tits up. No, I'm not like that. Oh, what the fuck? Well, that would be about right, wouldn't it? What a useless thing that was for me, yeah. These are doing all right. Here we go. There's no way they're pushing us off this hill. That's a certainty. Just keep chucking pillums because we don't have time to muck about with these bad boys. Go on, chuck some. Yes! That's right! Steady, eh? The hell? Right, okay, we're winning on the hill. Pity about that cavalry, though. But once we see these buggers off, then all will be good. Wavering? No, kill these, kill these! I don't know if there's even a leader left there, but... There we go, one more. Wow, these have got a lot of morale. Wow! I am getting pissed off. Right, so what's going on here with the legions? Steady, yeah? Sounds about right. Right, what can, what can our guy do here? Can he actually force any of these off to... Uh, there we go, we can get rid of one maybe. Let's have a look, see which ones are... are not doing so well. Just some encouragement there. Had we had cavalry, obviously we would have smashed into the back of these a lot long ago. But I made a stupid tactical error. But I'm going to have to uh, face the music on that. So there we go. Going good up here. Oh, yes! I'm actually going to use my uh, general to smash through. And if we are lucky, capitalise on this opportunity. Well, here we go, we're going to wrap up. We're going to wrap up. Oh, yes! Right, we're going to sandwich any minute now. Are you ready, guys? Right, and instead of... No, actually, let's just let them fire the last of their fire arrows. Let's crunch in on these as well next. This is excellent news. We really give the enemy a good pummeling. Aside from that stupid tactical error of um that stupid tactical error we had earlier with the uh, cavalry. We've done very well. And I'm pretty pissed off with that because Here we go. Oh my god, we have, this is a killing ground. There was no way they were going to push me off this hill though. It was impossible. Impossible. There we go. How's about them apples, eh? Just in time as well, because the auxiliaries couldn't hold on any longer. What the hell? Where'd these buggers come from? 
Wow! Well, I wasn't expecting that at all. I'll go after them ones. Oh, I like that bird that just flew past. That was very nice. Come on, guys. Let's wrap up. Yeah, there we go. Costly victory. Ah, well. Well, there we go. Toletum is ours. A Pyrrhic victory. It wasn't... I think we done very well there. But there we go. Let's, uh kill the captives because we really don't need this right now bankrupt don't know how the hell we're being bankrupt but there we go anyhow guys I think we should continue this and find out what happens in the next session of let's funking play Octavian Rome thank you for watching goodbye <laughs>